Hi guys, Daniel Kazinis back here again. Today we're working on the tunnel hull inboard surface drive, or the Steve for short. I know you guys are always talking about me not wearing toe protection in the workshop, and this happened. What happened is I was pulling the pull start like this, the boat came up in the air, and it fell down onto my foot. Ah! Boats and toes, boats and toes. So I've learned my lesson, let's get back to work. <laughs> Right, got a few things done. Got the plush seat here, luxury interior. Got the wood here, so my legs got room without getting roasted up by the motor. Just tack the nut on this drive shaft so it won't do up anymore and it stays in line. I fixed up this propeller, but it's a this is an eight and a half inch and it's made for a 13 horsepower. So I just I'll just trim the ends off a little bit just to reduce it because I know that this motor's not going to push it. So I can try that prop and this prop just painted up this bracket and I'll put a bolt in there so the rudder doesn't go down so fast so it doesn't hit the prop anymore this bush that was the problem last time is a nut that's wound wide up inside there but it's bottomed out so it's actually it's all right now I'm happy with how it is I'm just gonna run it like that they want to be sink again not sinking today are you sure not like last time eh Okay, so there's quite a swift current today, so we've got to make sure that we get running. We don't have any problems or we're going to get swept downstream. <laughs> oh well it works pretty good but it won't turn there's a sock a sock i think it's a shirt i think what we'll do is we'll keep going but you can use the oar and steer us a bit with the oar i cannot stand. all you need to do is drag it the side that we need to turn so if we want to turn this way you drag the oar on the on the side okay Correct. okay i'm going to start up and go straight and you need to drag the oar on this side okay you understand
one's dodgy. We're stuck. Go forward. I can. Alright, give me the oar. Right, here we go. Yeah, we'll turn back. We'll slowly turn back. Yeah, man, look how fast the river is. It's actually just been like raining hard out for ages. That's why the river's so fast. Yeah. And that was amazing, Amy. Eh, I was so scared. I was like, no, we're going to crash. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we could just don't start the motor yet. No, I don't. Oh, I think we'll just leave the motor off till we get back. Yeah, because then it's going to be a little bit dangerous. Because then it'll go kneel and drift and we'll jump and then we'll sink. It's, oh man, you did really well on the steering, Mia. Well done. It took so much poor strength. Yeah. <laughs> the, um, the rudder doesn't work very good. Oh no. It's a dip. It's a dip. It's a rapid. Oh. No, we can't go down rapid that easy. Uh. Oh, this is actually quite harming. Oh, that is really good. It's probably a little bit slow, but I thought it was, um, I thought it was cool. And, and like, we're fighting against this difficult river the whole time. Oh, hey, running. we crash into the land and you want to video me coming up here? Babe, uh, oh, no. Burn, burn, burn. Dude, straight oh, up, look at that big wave. Oh no! Wow! Oh, yeah! Yeah! They're awesome! <laughs> that was cool. Yeah, going up green is helping us. <laughs> and we got this far. Look how fast we're going. Yeah. We're almost faster than the motor. <laughs> yeah, because the motor was fighting all of this. Yeah. It's actually quite amazing. Oh no. Here it comes. I'm trying to turn. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I thought we were gonna like about when we got up to like that bit all the way up there, I thought we were gonna like sink. Yeah. We had so many close calls. We did. That was an accident. We're trying to stop the film. Can we get over here, maybe? Oh! Oh, oh. 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 Okay, Mia. We have to jump and jump out in here. Okay. See guys, this clip keeps coming undone, I don't know why. It's pretty dodgy, I can't seem to clip it back in while we're moving. So all that's holding this boat together is this one clip. We find somewhere good to stop, we'll stop and fix that. And I also want to change it for colour. Oh, the motor's hydrolocked. What does that mean? It's full of water.
I hope I haven't ruined this motor. I think when I turned it off, the water rushed back up the exhaust pipe and went into the engine. Oh, I know why. Why? You know how motors get really hot? Yeah. So it's probably cooled it down too quickly? Too quickly and seized it. I think so too. It's too cooled it down too quickly. I can still pull the handle so it mustn't be totally seized. No. But it could have cracked a piston or a ring or something. Yeah. Maybe. It's a good diagnosis, Mia. Yeah, but the video just the case I pull it. Yeah. Why? It would be funny. How dare you? <laughs> well, guys, that was great. Um, when we went over the rapids, we had a few rocks. The prop bounced up out of the way, which was great. But now onto the bad stuff. The rudder absolutely was terrible. Barely steered it. But I bent this rod here to get out of the way of my leg. But as I was trying to steer, the red rod was bending. So I think it might be just a matter of that, or I don't know if the shape of the rudder is bad, or anyways, it was really bad. Maybe I need to pivot further out. Any of you guys that know about rudders, leave a comment. I'll try and sort that out. And then the other problem I had was the exhaust pipe. Water when I turned the motor off, would rush back in and then just go straight into the exhaust. I actually tried to make sharp angles here, so it would hoping it would stop, but I don't know, maybe I need a zigzag or something. Any advice on that would be good. And then the rubber boots mounting back down here that I had, that's almost totally melted through. The motor is in pretty bad shape. It's, uh, I need to get a new motor. This one's terrible. And it was super confusing using this and the hand. I only started getting used to it at the end, which was lucky because that's where the rapids were. I had to go out trying to run this bigger propeller, but the engine was full of water, so I wouldn't start. So I never got to try that. And it actually went all right. It was like planing with two of us, and then it was going up the rapids, which was super swift. So I'm pretty happy with it. It was really fun. So big thanks to my daughter Mia for helping me out. Um, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.